What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. Okay, folks, this is uh, Mr. Warmack, and I'm in the building. I'm going to do a video today about you know a topic which a lot of black people, African Americans, will be touchy about. And uh, you're going to see it in about two, three, you know, two... One. There you go. I'm going to go in on Jacko the Wacko, Michael Jackson, rest his soul. Uh, I want to talk about him today because I don't know how black folks still give this dude a pass in the community. I don't know how, after all the stuff he has done, he has got a pass in the community. I mean, you talk about how your uh, entertainers... Any black entertainer is a, a member of the Illuminati and your, uh, your NWOs and all that good stuff. But here's my here's my problem. You say your Jay Z's, your Fifties, your Dre's, your uh, Kanye's, your uh, any any black your Beyonce's, your Janet's, all, all your um, Whitney, Bobby, anybody, anybody that has done something that got to a certain peak or level, if you will, any type of a moderate, well, more than moderate success, anybody that's box office hits, any black person in general that's like in the public eye, you, you, people will label them as Illuminati's, they're sellouts, they do this, they do that, but what gets me is when it comes back to Michael Jackson, he, um, he could do no wrong. Now let me let me break it down. First of all, I don't want to hear no excuses about Joe Jackson. I don't want to hear well Joe Jackson beat Michael and this that the fifth. Look, Joe Jackson is a product of being a baby boomer probably. My well, man is a baby boomer. Those dudes always worked. Why well, I don't know why old man doesn't I think Joe was the same way. The factory always worked. Was he a little rough on his sons? Yes, he was. Uh, I mean, but all fathers are rough on his sons. What I think, and I'm going to say this up front, I think Michael had bigger demons in his younger years and just translated once he got by himself, it just came out. So we can we can, we can can not use the Joe Jackson defense because there are a lot of fathers who are more far worse. If you look at it, if, it, if it was Joe Jackson, why are the rest of the kids, how come they aren't wacko like he was? Everybody's going to say, well, LaToya, but LaToya, is steadily, LaToya had common sense. She just, within the last five to ten years, became some nut job talking about, I don't know what she thought, it was like a mystic psychic or whatever whatever she does. But uh, back to the topic at hand. Talk about Michael Jackson. If you saw that picture, look what he did to himself. He turned himself white. What for? What was what was the end game with that? You want to know why? Because he felt uncomfortable in his skin. And like I said, he had demons. We all have demons. But my point, the point I'm making in this video and I want to please, I want you guys to understand. I'm not going in on Michael Jackson. I'm just saying the same Illuminati, NWO, sellout things as you call these other entertainers, you have to label Michael Jackson that. Now I don't want to hear is, well, he was giving us messages. What, to turn white? Look at him. He, 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 he's, he's, he looked like he's white in the, that picture. You know, his kids don't look like him, supposedly. So the rumor has it there to the doctors, kids, you know. He he turned his, his back on his own family. I mean, I, I, the long list. There's a long list, but unfortunately, what the black community has done, all he had to do was get on top of that limo and dance and do do two thriller moves, and all of a sudden it was like, hey, back in business. But that's what you can do in the black community. Even though if you don't mean what you say, you can still get away because you're one of ours. And this is where he was never held accountable. Now everybody's gonna say, well, the doctor killed him. The doctor may have played a part in statewide, like, well, I mean, my fault. And maybe by going by the state definition, he may have, I don't know. But at the same time, Michael Jackson wasn't like, you know, the doctor had to, you know, get devices and open his mouth and throw drugs down his throat. Like I said, the man had demons, you know, we all have demons, I, I'm not putting that against him. Again, all I'm saying is... You got to put him in the same boat as you put all these Jay Z's, Kanye's, Dre's, 50's, uh, Beyonce's, Rihanna's, anyone that you say has a moderate or top notch level of success, 
You guys call them sellouts, this ass and the fur, but come to Michael Jackson, all of a sudden you're, you're a bunch of bleeding heart liberals. Go figure. And this is what you have to realize that Michael Jackson is in that same group. Now, you may get mad at me for what I'm going to say, because everybody keeps saying, well, he delivered a message. Well, look what he did. He waited till he was broke. And, and this is the point where you guys don't see it's all about the way it's done. He went to the last minute, I guess, till he, he was broke. He had he barely had this. He was selling assets. He was doing this. He was doing that. Yeah, everybody comes back to us. Look at OJ. When OJ got arrested for murder, he went and he he went trying to flee to Mexico. He came back. He came out. He came out of the, um, Los Angeles County lockup wearing a kufi and selling bean pies. I mean, it's 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 the old playbook in the black community. You can do anything to them, and they'll accept you for what you are. And that's the problem with us. We accept everybody for what they are and start, we need to start scrutinizing these people and hold them to a different standard. If you want to be in the limelight in the black community, be in the limelight in the black community. But you got to be holding the set, the set standard we'll, we'll define. So and I'm just making this video because I was, it, I, this was in one of my groups and they were like, uh, well, Michael Jackson gave a message. I'm like, what, to, to, to do the Sammy Sosa treatment? No, uh, and by the way, Sammy... Just because you turn white don't mean you're going to make the, the Hall of Fame, just just FYI. But uh, back to the lecture at hand. M Michael, I, I mean, I, I could easily go in on him, but I'm not because I'm not making this video about him. I'm just making this video about, well, he he he, he has to be in those group, in the same group. So you can't have, he, he didn't get to where he was without selling out. Look what he did to his family and his father. You know, look what he did to Gary in the end. He didn't do anything, so... I just make this short video. I'm out. Peace.